It took a while to get used to sleeping with the machine connected to you. You know, wearing the mask, the headgear, the tubing, and sleeping on my side, and realizing there was something there. At first, it was hard to get comfortable. It took a while before I worked out how to make the equipment work for me. I didn't need to put my mask on too tightly, I found out. I noticed that if I put my hand underneath my uh, cheek and adjusted the pillow, I was fine, I was comfortable. And that's when I noticed my sleep started to really improve. Making therapy comfortable doesn't have to be hard. In fact, it's designed to be easy. You just need to know what to do. More importantly, learn how to fit your mask correctly. This can make a big difference. If you have a dry mouth or stuffy nose, try adjusting your humidity settings. Find out what works for you. Let yourself experiment with different sleeping and tubing positions. Soon enough, you'll know exactly what you need for a comfortable night's sleep. I can rarely sleep without my machine now. I am so used to it. I'm comfortable at night and my husband sleeps well next to me. I get quality sleep. What felt awkward at first now feels quite normal. I'm Pamela and I've been getting great sleep since 2001.